Okay, so I'm going to show you how to make a signature or a banner, depending on what you want, using GIMP. It's basically going to end up looking like this in the background. Open up a new picture. I'm going to have 640 by 200. And you're going to open up your layer, uh, your render. And copy it and paste it until the white is completely filled. I want the white and red to be the main colors of the signature, so I'm going to keep it like that. Okay, once you're done with that, make sure this is anchored so you don't do it to that. Uh, your, uh, so you do it to your whole thing, your whole uh, picture. You're going to do a Gaussian blur, blur. Doesn't matter what you set it to. I'm just going to set it mine to 15. So it looks like this. Open up a new layer. Make sure it's set to white. Go to artistic and GIMP persist, pr pr persistent. I, I don't really know what that is. It should look like this if it doesn't, or it may be bigger or smaller, depending. doesn't really matter. If it doesn't look like that, you have a different brush. You're going to have to go to Spear. Okay, so now it looks like this. You're going to want to do a Blur. Motion Blur. doesn't matter what you have it set to. I'm going to use 256 and 62. So now it looks like this. You're going to want to go to your Layers and set it to overlay so it looks like that. Then you're going to open up another new layer, set it to transparency, and then you want to get your brushes and just brush over it with the whatever color that you want to be your main color in your uh, sig. The brushes I'm using, I don't really know where I got them from, so I cannot provide a link. I'm sorry about that. Sorry, that was a... That one has an automatic color on it for some reason. But, um... Just get a bunch of brushes, a brush over it. Okay, then you're going to change the mode to overlay or um, soft light or just something that you find good for, you, good for your choice. I am going to use Ooh, that looks pretty good, but it's going to screw up the signature. So I'm going to use color. darken those parts. Okay, so once you're done with that, open up a new layer. We're going to do another ballpark. So, you know, set it to white. Go back into your filters, artistic, gimp persistent, and you're going to want to do another ballpark. Same thing you did with the last ballpark. Or if you want, you can change it up yourself. You know, it doesn't really matter. And then just change all this just keep it the same you had it or just change it if you want I am gonna put this into soft light or overlay it doesn't really matter what you use just make sure it looks pretty good okay once you're done with that you're gonna open up your get your render and you're gonna want to you're gonna to want to scale the image so look so go with the the 
that looks good. It should show up really good on my uh, signature. So just copy it. And then go back into this. You're going to want to open up another new layer. Make sure this is set to transparency so it doesn't screw up. And you want to go pa paste your layer. Just put it wherever you want. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to put mine there. And then I'm going to set it to... Actually, I should set the mode before I do it. I'm going to put this in the middle. And then I'm going to play around with the mode. It's kind of cool. He disappeared. Um... Okay, I know what I did wrong here. You're gonna want to you have to anchor them before you're messing with the mode. I like it like this. Because you can still sing them. Or, you know, it doesn't really matter what setting you have it on. Then you're going to want to add text. It doesn't matter what you use. Just use, you know, just get whatever text you think is good for it. I'm going to use Inked God, which I will include in the um, description. And then you're going to have to find a color that you actually like with it. Open up a new layer. Make sure it's set to transparency. The reason I did it in blue is just to see what it would show up as if I did it in a certain setting. I like this, so I'm going to move it so I can actually see it. Actually, I'm gonna put it over here. Hey, okay, there we go. Stupid. There. <laughs> yeah, I just wasted two minutes trying to figure out where to place the text. Well, that's basically it. I will upload more, just for fun, I guess. I doubt I'm going to get any views on this, but anyways. Yep, that's it, so...